up guys, Beyblade OG here, back in the YouTube video, and today we're finally back guys, and today we're going to be doing a special new tutorial video on how to get Minecraft mods for free in 2017, and this is the easiest way you can get mods guys, I guarantee that 100%, and it's free, and it's legal, and no other obligations towards that, so guys, and I'm really sorry for not like uploading for a while and I've been like been seeing that from my from like my recent uploads and I'm really sorry about that guys I have a really starch and heavily uh, packed schedule throughout the summer so I wasn't able to like dearly upload and commit to YouTube but with summer coming to an end and all my tasks coming to a little end like nearly to an end I can start to upload daily and I should be able to do that in a couple weeks. So guys if you don't see like videos daily in, in these couple weeks, I'm really sorry about that. But it should be coming out soon. Don't worry guys, I will be back. I won't leave you guys. So with that thought guys, uh, come on and go to my channel right now. First off, first first to first of all, oh my god. Oh, you wanna go to my channel and go subscribe guys. Please do subscribe as it would help me out really and it would help me commit to making more videos and uploading more stuff for you guys. And as I do many cool stuff, I also do a lot of cool Minecraft stuff. So go onto my channel guys, I would highly appreciate it if you guys go subscribe, like, comment, and share this with your friends as it would help you guys out and their, their friends out. And with that thought, let's get right into the tutorial. So first things first. Now it's said already. <laughs> okay, so what you want to do is go into the first link, which is uh, WinRAR. So WinRAR, okay. You know, if you don't have this zip extracting program, it's to basically help you extract your zip, which will be we will be doing throughout this tutorial later on. So and what you will be doing to get your mods out of the zip folder. So this basically extracts the. Uh, uh, the zip folder into a file that is inside the zip so you can install it for your 32 bit or your 62 bit so most people already have this but this is for the people who don't have it so next thing is that you want to go to minecraft forge and this is another thing about, like similar to this zip scenario zip um, in mean the one hour scenario most people have this most people don't it usually comes with minecraft when you install it but some people tend to not have it as they update their Minecraft through later versions. So depending on what mod we're going to be downloading in step number three, you're going to be you have to know which mod you're going to get for the forge. So with that thought, we're going to be going to the next step, which is step number three. So this is Skydaz. We'll be going back to forge. So basically, this site is a Minecraft installer slash tool mods mad maps and texture pack like uh, basically an info page on where to get your mods and everything else and basically this is where you will be getting your mods and you can search up the mods that you guys want such as like optifine or not enough items and etc so you guys can go search up your maps i mean your mods and go download so what i'm going to be doing guys is Basically, I'm going to be installing a mod for 1.11 as there's no mods for 1.12 right now because there's many developers who are still developing their mods to get onto the latest updates such as Not Enough Items. And most of the big mods such as Not Enough, not enough Items, Optifine, all these big mods are all the way here. And there's many, many, many mods that are in 1.12. 1.11.2 and the further ones and these all mods go all these mods go back to the previous updates such as 1.2.5 so with that fact i'm going to be installing a mod for 1.11.2 but you guys can go search up the mod that you guys want for your specific version and what you want to do once you find your mod you want to go continue reading so i'm just going to go for the first one enhance visual mod and what you're gonna you're gonna get onto this page and once you get onto this page there's gonna be like a couple of videos to help you guys out with the mod and you can ignore it or watch it but you wanna go all the way down to the downloads page and you wanna click download here zip and it'll give it like a little pop-up ignore this when 
X has expired. And what you want to do is minimize this uh, uh, Chrome. And once you get the pop up, you want to extract it to your desktop, and it'll take like less than a second. And you can close that off, and you can leave this here for now. Now the next step is it you want to know what uh, mod like what like what did you install for like 1.11 or 1.12. 11.2 and you want to know the specific download so you can get the version onto forge so i got it for this enhanced visuals mod for 1.11.2 so you want to go into the 1.11.2 uh in uh, tab and in forge.com net i mean and you want to go into this tab and download the recommended Windows install and it'll take a couple seconds and this is only for the people who don't have Forge if you have Forge uh, you can skip this part and wait until I get to it and guys now you just install it and install the client it'll take like two seconds and it's good this is completely free and it is secure guys so now you can minimize this stuff and once you installed Forge for one point for the mod that you have you want to go click on the mod folder that you extracted onto your desktop and you want to click on this like uh, what do you call it boxes red create crates or whatever you call it and you want to click on it and you get the installer page for your mod so now what you need to do is just click install and if you want to back up your minecraft you can do it i'm going to press no because i don't need it and it will quickly install it depends on what mod you install it will take time depending on what mod you install and you just install for the version forge default and you can close this and i recommend that you guys keep this it's like hidden or somewhere in your folders as you will need it later on safe on perhaps if your mod breaks down you can go repair it in that same page that we opened up so what you want to do is once you get your forge installed you want to go click play on forge and you want to click play okay never mind you want to go to your launch options and add a new one and you want to go to the latest we, uh, depending on which forge you download you want to go uh, and save a new uh, what do you call it preset and then once you get the latest preset you want to go onto it and click play and it will start unpacking the mod and installing it as we down put it into the mod folder and it will take a couple of seconds as it finishes and install it initializes the pack two hours later come on let's go there you go and that is how you install mods any update for free and it's the easiest way you can do it so guys please go subscribe as if this worked and if it didn't work for you guys go in the description and comment down your errors so i can help you guys out so guys, thank you guys so much for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time, peace out.